Hello everybody and welcome to Zoe's demo. This demo is designed for teachers. Some of the things that uh, we're trying to highlight here is uh, why use this system and how do you know where a child is struggling and why they are struggling and here we are seeking to address the educational gaps. Our system can help you do that. How do you measure child's effort in their education without monitoring their involvement? How do you know how much a child is putting in? And with our system, you are able to measure and monitor the child's effort in their education. How do you productively partner with parents in their child's education? Our system enables you to work with parents as it gives parents access to be able to view their child's performance and assignments that you give to them. Do you find educational resources readily available and child engaging? Our system provides engaging educational resources, resources you can use to ensure that you're keeping the interests of the children uh, as they are doing their work. Less time consuming reports, how painful reports must be for teachers. How time consuming is it to produce school reports? Our system in a very simple way does help produce reports in a seamless manner without much effort. How are you helping children below or above grade level? And here we are talking about remedial tools that this system provides that a child can learn according to their ability. If the child is below grade level, they are discouraged. If they are above grade level and they are learning at grade level, they get disengaged, disinterested. This system does help a child to be more engaged, more challenged and more encouraged to uh, be involved in educational activities. Performance assessment. How well are your children doing? Is your performance assessment based on local or international standards? And I think that it is very important for us as educationists to raise the standard of education that is not just based on local standards but on international standards. The system does help with performance assessment. With that in place, let's now get to a demo. And at this particular point, I will now switch and get you to see what we are talking about. Over here, as you can see from uh, this um, view, is I've actually logged in as a teacher. So let me log out and so that you're able to see what is seen before logging in. And so literally what happens here is you have the Zwiz and I'll click on Zwiz, which provides, it, it takes you onto the, um, the very home page and that's how it looks like. Let's just explain here, Zwiz is based on Flash technology. And so when you come to this website for the first time and you log in, one of the things which can be quite painful, the system will require you to do is to download Flash, the latest Flash. So you might have a Flash, which is a fresh, which is a free version, it's a free software. 
and if you've got an old version the system will request that you download the latest version so just something that comes up and it's not that the system is not working but that is something that normally comes up okay so i will log in as a um i will log in as a teacher and that is the everything is in my system and so i'll log in there so what we're going to do in this particular section is to just demonstrate have a quick overview bird's eye view of what a system is about and then in subsequent um, uh, training modules i'll walk you through specific items and activities so we keep these demonstrations short everything that needs to be known everything that you need to know about zoe's as a teacher are found in the menu just click there and if you forget you'll be able to see it and it is there over here of course it takes you to the home page so if you clicked on that it takes you to the home page and the page that you get to see which is that page back to the menu here you have my class anything to do with your class you can literally look at the recent activities recent activities as far as the students activities are concerned you can set adaptive work the custom work which we'll look at in the subsequent training and you also can can uh, generate uh, and show the um, uh, the the passwords and the reports that we talked about there you can see the view custom work re results view reports and advanced statistics and all that will be known and they're very much straightforward when we walk through them the other one is the class admin you are able to see the class you're able to, to view all classes you can create a class and we'll be able to demonstrate that in this second um, uh, demonstration and in this one you can also add st students to a class and there are some similar things that are um, that are also in the student admin but more importantly and something to take note is to import student list you can import the student list and you also can also print the parent letters this is the letters that can be printed and be given to students so they can go home and tell their parents about it all remove from the school uh, remove from school that can be done by a teacher and then you've got information about the school and and the like so this is about it all in terms of what the menu is about and the different uh, um, um, uh, functionalities that are available of course got the home home will take you to uh, the as you can see it takes you right there there's a quick view and then you you have the um, you have the reports you have the advanced statistics and this is where you set the work and that is helpful okay having done that i must mention here that most of the training and all the training as far as using zoe's is concerned they are already contained in within the system so you don't have to pay extra everything that you need to know is is contained in there now there's something that is quite interesting like we are in the home page and so when you click the the video there that video that you you should see that video should say something about the the home page and so it walks you through that um, it walks you through the um, provides the overview for the teacher interacting to teacher and the management module key uh as always concept and so on and you can click on that and that can 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 play and i uh, will just play it for for a few seconds and we've got my friend there jason who does a wonderful job in doing the uh, in doing the training and uh, and that's jason riley a lovely young man okay so that's one of those things that you need to do and um we'll go back and to and of course down here you'll be able to see the student when the student logs in they can log in as Zoe's mobile they can log in and they can find information about for the for the kids information that they need to know about the, the children you can see that I just click on that one 
and it will load and all that information they need to know about the games they play and so on and so forth all that is readily available and then they the parents also have login information about the parents and that also is there so in terms of the, if the parents are really interested what happens is when the parent has uh, one you know uh, logs in they are able to link their login to their existing child and so that is and then if they, they bought a voucher they can claim the voucher um, using that so all that information is available and it talks about the tags and the like um, the other thing that is helpful here is of course the teachers so you've got the the management module as demonstrated in the menu and then this you can share this is a provision so like you as a teacher if you love the system very much you can actually share and when you click on that um, it it actually opens up your um, it opens up your your outlook and so you can send an email and then there is a guide a getting started guide which you can get venture into and that again there are videos that walks you all that so even if you forget and you're not sure about something you've got all the information at the fingertip um, and then we also got here the the printable thing you can click on that and you can get all the information about Zoe's. So that's a guide and that's readily available. And for those who like a printed material, there you have it. Um, and um, the other thing that you get to see under that, and then of course you've got the book, um, a walkthrough, and that basically this is what we are trying to do here. And then there are other, inf these other information that you might be in in interested in, you've got the educational content, the features, what does it involve? And so you've got all that information readily available um, and you'll be able to see it will, It gives you all that information about the, the website, the help and training, uh, reviews, awards, and so on and so forth. All that information is readily available for us to do. And so back to the management module, a place where you'll be living and doing everything that you need. That is what we have there. Um, you then uh, can appreciate what this is about. So that forms a quick overview of what Zoeys is about. In the next training module, we will be looking at specific things. We'll be doing some tasks such as creating a class and adding students to a class and a few other things. All right, but for now, um, it is, it's been great and uh, thank you for, for listening.